we are not issuing a new strike notice a subsequent to the issues of the SRC we had issued a strike notice and we had a timeline that we agreed that we are working on failure of which they have not actually met the time as we agreed so we will be commencing on our strike if they don't meet or rather confine a meeting or rather remit the solution uh, meet the solutions uh, provide the solution on the issues that we have raised. So the clinical officers outside there who have been act working with a lot of uh, as pleasure, pressure, we want to say that they will be done their, true, their tool and they will go on strike without any further notice as we have provided on this number of issues. Failure of paying, this, they are, they are paying them in time and actually failure of providing solution on the SRC job evaluation issues and the pain of return. I think we have been pushed into a corner. How do you expect people to work when you have not paid them for two months? How do you expect interns to continue working for a full year without paying them and yet you are paying others and you have in place an internship policy that provides that they should be paid? It's really unacceptable. How do you allow a strike in an essential sector like health to go for a record 100 days when people are suffering, people are dying? I think it's high time as Kenyans, we also look at the leaders we have. We also look at the holders of the respective offices because I believe this should be seen for what it is. It is hypocrisy, it is incompetence, and if they are not able to deliver the functions of their offices, it's high time the holders of these offices resign so that they can give a chance to a Kenyan who is able to be able to come in and resolve and stabilize this sector.